look at. Right now, there are other rattlesnakes that are here. And we've got two more together. Hard to tell if those two are mating or not, but uh, here. Anyway, this spot is very productive. There's a lot of rattlesnakes dinned up in here. I'll come back by in a minute and go scout some more areas. One thing I've noticed, if you take a good look right next to this rattlesnake right here, there's lots and lots of rodent droppings. I bet you these snakes, there's got to be a, probably a cycle between when the rodents are interactively used and the snakes are hibernating. Maybe both hibernate, I don't know. But there was clearly rodent activity and these rattlesnakes don't look skinny. We'll go look for some more. His tail is wrapped around that of the females and uh, they haven't exactly started mating just yet but they're about to or they might be but it's slightly concealed and we can't see it actually occurring but uh, he's moving his head up and down the body of the female and with his tongue flicks he's picking up her scent which I'm assuming coming out of hibernation this early in the year She's probably fresh with a lot of good hormones and everything and signaling with chemical scent uh, that she's ready to mate. And so he's probably becoming imbibed with those uh, pheromone secretions from her uh, more than likely. That's, that's my, my take. But uh, places like this can be really exciting to look for snakes. And uh, you just have to be careful because you don't know how many are out.